Hey, what's going on dudes? Um, I've had a few questions on how I got my rank slash MMR on my stream and how it updates every time and stuff like that. So I'm going to quickly show you guys on how to do that. So what you're going to want to do is just, you're going to want to go to a website called R6Tab. And uh, if I knew how to type, we'd be there already. But from R6Tab, you're going to want to search a player name that you want. So like probably one of your accounts or if you want to do a friend's account. I don't know. So you're going to want to do that. You want to grab the profile link at the top here with control C or right click copy and you want to go to the stream widget on the left side here that's basically going to create this uh, little box thing for you so you want to paste the link you just copied right here and you'll see it update right there for you that way you know that the profile is registered and then this is the background color where this gray transparent thing is you can go to any website you want if uh, you were curious on what how to change the colors and stuff like that you can just change them by sliding these bars here and you're taking these three numbers and you find the color you want and you're gonna put them right here and then from that next you're gonna want to change the transparency I just go zero and it'll make the thing completely vanish in the background that way uh, it's completely transparent you can see right through it, whatever it doesn't really interrupt anything that's the way I like it but you might like it different that's completely up to you um, it goes anywhere from 0 to 99 99 I'm assuming is full black correct so yeah from there you're gonna go from here this is uh this is if you want it on left or right so you'll just change it to the left side if you want on the left or just keep it on the right if you want on the right i'm going to show you why that doesn't really matter in a few seconds here but then after that you're going to want to take the widget url this is what's going to create your thing in your stream so you're going to copy that by Control c or right click copy and you're going to want to open up your stream labs from there, you're going to want to go to this plus. You're going to want to double click on the browse source. Name this whatever you'd like. doesn't really matter. And then from there, you're going to hit, you're going to highlight this. And you're going to hit control V. And then from there, you hit done. And then you'll see it pop up. This is why the left and right didn't matter. Because if you hold alt and just drag this along the way here and get it how you like it lined up, you can move it anywhere you want on the screen. doesn't really matter. Top, right, top left, bottom left, bottom right. That's why when it was created, it didn't really matter where, where it was because you can still move it however you'd like. So that's uh, pretty much it. And it auto-updates by itself uh, pretty much as soon as you finish a game, win a game, lose a game. doesn't really matter. It'll update. But yeah, other than that, uh, I guess I'll see you guys next time. If you guys have any more questions on anything to do with streaming, let me know down in the comment section below. And I will... Uh, Help you guys out as much as possible. See you guys later. Peace.